uh, welcome back to the channel. Uh, Margaret had a question uh, on my uh, my easel video, and we were talking about the uh, the uh, ball head connection for on the tripod right here. And so I just thought I would take a moment and show her how the how the cleat connects. Um, and I, this uh, I don't know. This is kind of like this is the core of why I believe my system really works with that particular easel is uh, is because of this. Um, first of all, this knob that locks the ball into place is like really big, um, gets a really firm grip. I don't have any slop in this system at all. And uh, when you tighten this up on the cleat, it actually gives you a really nice connection without any play in it whatsoever. And uh, yeah, so there you go, Margaret. That's, uh, that's why I like it. And um, I hope this is helpful. All right, so um, today uh, I'm in the flower fields, and but they're not flowers yet. But it's, I'm a little bit early for that. But I had an opportunity today to paint again, and man, how fortunate am I to to uh, actually get a shot at coming back out, uh, coming back out and painting again um, this week, um, which I'm super grateful for. The weather is beautiful, and. Uh, flowers or no flowers this place never uh, ceases to uh, uh, excite me and inspire inspire me to paint so um, I'll show you what I'm gonna what I'm gonna do here today I'm looking up this I mean everywhere I look it's uh, it's just green on top of green on top of green there are lots of varieties in these greens um, but it doesn't really matter what direction I look I'm kind of dealing with greens I like the yellows in uh, kind of uh, some little orangey kind of colors that are in kind of these bushes that that well I say bushes but they're really saplings um, they're going to become full-grown trees but they uh, and actually they're growing really fast but um, yeah so I really like I really like the way they kind of bracket this uh, this path but what I really like the most is the way the light is kind of uh, shining through the transparency of these leaves here and really setting them off against a kind of a dark green background and I'm gonna move that light around a little bit so it's actually these branches that are in this tree right here um, so that they're actually gonna be uh, uh, lit up against that darker background there um, so I'm just gonna kind of take that and just imagine I move the Sun a little sooner than it's gonna actually move but um, anyway uh, yeah, so that's what I've got going on. Um, I just have to get uh, my easel out, get set up, I get a quick sketch going, and uh, yeah, Dan, thanks so much for hanging out. Let's uh, let's see what we can do here.
right, so that's it for me today. And thank you so much for uh, checking out the video. Um, I really do appreciate it. And uh, yeah, man, what a gorgeous day. I mean, it's crazy windy and you probably saw the uh, umbrella fly off and uh, stuff like that, but it's designed to do that. So uh, uh, Peggy at uh, Artwork Essentials makes a really nice umbrella and instead of wrecking your whole rig and taking it down when the wind catches the umbrella, it just comes out of the tube and the little tether keeps it from flying away and yeah, it just works. And uh, so I really, uh, I really like that. So good job, Peggy. And uh, hopefully next week I'll get to see Peggy uh, when I'm back out in California, we're gonna try and get together. But anyway, um, this is about the video and man, I've, I'm actually pretty happy with this. You know, every time I come to this place, it's, uh, it just always inspires me. And it doesn't matter what direction I paint or what I choose. And uh, I can't wait to come back when the flowers are all out and actually some of them have, uh, have even popped out a little bit while I've been standing here. A lot of butterflies and stuff cruising around. Um, just amazing, just gorgeous. So anyway, uh, look forward to that. It'll be a revisit of the uh, flower fields, uh, which is a video that I'm sure a lot of you have found my channel by. It's, I think it's my most popular video. I don't know why that happens, but sometimes it does. Um, but anyway, uh, yeah, here's, uh, here's how I ended up. Um, and kind of get a look at that and uh this is my kind of messy palette i did clean it off uh clean it off once but uh for those of you who like to see what's left of the paint piles there you go and uh yeah cool so uh if you're not a subscriber before you go hit the subscribe button the bell notification i'll make sure you don't miss anything and uh as always i will uh i'll catch you later